Hello and welcome back to City Skylines 2. Thank you very much for joining me in today's video. Last time out, I worked on some flyovers, as you can see, one and two with some better slip roads. I built a harbour and then realised that I cannot use said harbour, although for some reason things are being stored here. I built some extra industrial areas, which, I'll be honest, does not look very nice and I will probably be redoing this entire section. I went and tried out some forestry, figured out how that works, which is actually quite good. Um, it is good to figure this one out and understand what I need to do with it because going forward that may be something that I, I work on. Perhaps trying to add some forestry in, in this area and cut some of this back. Uh, what else did I do? I added another primary school at the end and was a little bit confused about fire stations and fire engines and why things do not move out the way. In today's video, I'm going to be working on this little road spur that I've started here, which is currently called the Mulberry Highway. And I'm going to build it all the way around to pro probably near this area but i haven't yet decided where the junction for the motorway is going to be so i'm just going to build it all the way around connect this particular road up to it and then see if i can connect this road up to this main road here as well which then opens up this entire area for me to start putting housing and all that sort of stuff but before i do any of that i need to put a hospital in so make sure you stay tuned for some hospitals for some trunk road creation and then if i do get time i will start looking into the subways the underground railway system as i said i would and see if that is something that will be viable at this particular time in the city of knightsbridge so let's get started. Let's see what I can get up to and if I can do everything that I just said. Oh, look, a fire. OK, just something I've noticed. That is a plane. That shadow there is the USS Defiant for those people who watch Star Trek. So that is a little strange. Okay, what was the first thing? Yes, hospital. I want to put a hospital in. Um, so the hospital, I could put directly on the main road, which is probably a good idea. So I'm going to do that. The hospital is going to be directly on the main road. Um, or I say main road, on this ring road like that and then immediately is going to have a helipad placed on it and um, what was that an extra ward and a trauma center applied to it so we have a and e there we go people should now be very happy because we have a hospital uh, looks like that burnt down now something's happened here I just do not understand why the fire brigade cannot do we do we not have a fire station on that? We do not. I suppose that is probably... Well, we have that one, which can respond. Um, Lindbergh Street is going to become, become very important. So, I think... I may be looking at putting some fire stations and stuff around that area. That is not what I'm concerned about at the moment. I just wanted to check the uh, health care. There we go. And just make sure that we are okay there. Yes, that works. Oh, yes. I did need to put a, one of those crematorium things. There's another Defiant. Uh, one of those crematorium things in. Where would I find that? Healthcare. Duh. I'll just pop that right next to... I have no idea where to fit one of these. Can I just pop it in anywhere? Is there any road I can put this in? Here. Why don't I just pop it in here? People may be happy, may not be happy about this. 
I do not know. Uh, this bit? No. All these overlapping items are rather annoying. Uh, okay, opposite cemetery. Sure. This, this may be the best option. There we go. That is where that bit, that now is. Uh, smooth some of this out. Still trying to do this. Doesn't really work when, when you... So I think what I have to do... This is what I think I have to do. I have to do that. Create a slope to that point. Like this. And then go ahead and start softening the terrain. And I think that is how I'm going to have to do all of this to to actually get these smoother um, sides. Otherwise, it just does not work. Okay. So, I said I was going to work on the trunk road. So, this is a... Let's say this is a dual carriageway of some sort coming in from some town. So, the way I'm going to do this, I'm just going to build build it fairly, you know, just in a in a slightly haphazardish I say slightly haphazardish manner, but it isn't quite. And then at this point, what I'm going to do is I know it's going through here, but I also know that this road is coming up here and will be joining here. So I'm going to Grab this road, which is a six-lane divided road. And start building this up towards that junction. And then here is where things are going to change. So now, this is, um, I suppose, going to be end up being a roundabout since A roads in, in the UK have a roundabout. I'm just going to give this a, a name. A... Sure, this can be the A5. It isn't quite the Roman road. I mean, there are parts that are fairly straight-ish. Should really be much straighter than that if it's the A5, though. Um, and so because it isn't that straight, I'm going to call it the A6. There you go. Job done. Um, actually, north, south, east, west, uh, A1, A3, that will do. Okay, that will end up becoming a roundabout, but then here, this is probably going to end up becoming, I don't think we're going to end up with a, do I want to leave this as a, What I'm concerned about, I know I'm just blabbering on randomly right now. What I'm concerned about is if I left this as two lane, will it, will it actually be suitable or will it very, very quickly descend into traffic, uh, some sort of traffic pandemonium? That is what I'm concerned about. Right, 60, 50 metres. Oh, let's put the angle on again. Why does it not snap to that 90 degrees? Uh, no idea. None of, none of that's doing what I wanted to do. There's the 90. Can I zoom in further to make this easier? I can. I should probably pause this because that's where I can actually remain in day daytime. Which is kind of important. Uh, snap to existing geometry. How do I do that? There we go. 50 and... Oh, now it wants to keep the 90. Okay. 50... 
50 and 50. 50 and round. There we go. Okay. And then you... Oh, you know what? Just because I've messed that up a little, you just continue like this right up to here and these are these are also somewhat valid junctions um, but so we'll probably split it just a bit because I, I do want to have something that looks a little bit better so like that and like that probably Yes, that will work. And then on the opposite side, I will do the same thing. So I'll just put it back. Let's put it back here just to start with. And I'll work on the, I'll work on the bridge area in a minute. And then what I can do is I can turn this Aspen Highway. This is the A2. There you go. And even all the way in here, this could be called the A2. It doesn't really matter. So, I suppose that could be the A1, if that's the M1. Sure, A1. Why not? Um, that that can that will do. Two lanes from here. There to there, and from this side to there. That is surprisingly that that is working surprisingly well. And then comes the more difficult bit, which is this three-lane connection, which I will bring this road a little bit closer like that and then try to do this three lane connection which if I switch all of these on it may still let me connect like that and then now see that that is not quite what that is not what I want maybe that now wait switch all of this off and just manually do this there now, I think that th nobody should be allowed to go around, so there should be a way... I know there's a way for me to do this. So you can say no right turn there. And no right turn here. And then remove those traffic lights. Ah, no UEs, good. So it figured out that, that that was a Yui. Excellent. That hasn't quite panned out how I wanted it to be there anyway. But still, that is something. So, we now have a connection out there. That also means that this bit can be connected. So this is a... This is just a standard... Oh, this is a four-lane road. Right, okay. So this is a standard four-lane road which I can just try to build up up to here but probably will look at putting a oh do I have to is the question so what I could do what I could do is this say a, a tighter turn there like that and uh that's for traffic coming in and then I can also do at the same time a fairly tight turn there like that which allows traffic across I want to do I want to try a different type of junction that is what I want to do just to see if it's it's doable 
So, as I said, the first one I want to do is that. And then the second one I want to do is the exact same kind of junction, but in that direction, like that. There. Okay. Then what I need to do is I need to say that you over here, this is, you cannot turn that way. Right. And similarly here, you cannot turn that way. And you have to turn that way. So yeah, you have to turn that way. And you have to turn that way. That works. That could actually be a really interesting junction. So there we go. I've done something else there. Good. Uh, where was all that water stuff? It somewhere. This is still, as I said, not something I'm particularly keen on. How do I bring in that natural resource thing? So there are more natural resources here. How do I... There's some fertile land here as well. Because what I want to do is maybe turn this into some sort of processing yard sort of thing. Mm, that might help. Maybe. Just maybe. I'm not entirely certain. Potentially do the same here. Right. So that is that bit now done. So I guess I can start this... Uh, I can get this running. I then want to cross the river and I want to join up to the A2 junction. How am I going to do that now? So that would be you. Can I just bridge across? Will it just work? Yes, it will. There we go. This is just completely happy to do that. In fact, I'll just pull this back a little and try and make this a junction like so. And perhaps here I should just upgrade this to a motorway. This is the A1. No, this is the A2. Yeah, that, that works quite well for me. There. That could work. And then I suppose here, what I can do is apparently cause all sorts of grief. Now, that, that is what I want to do. Uh, where's that three-lane one? That is a three-lane one. So there is a way, apparently, of turning this around. So do I just... There we go. And do the same thing here. Okay. Things are looking a little bit better. Um, maybe if I now switch all of that off, I can upgrade this to actually work a little bit more realistically. Uh, there. Perfect. Kind of. Okay, so that is that junction done. And then I would say this would curve off in, in this direction. So if I continue building this, that's one. I have this curve off in, in this direction. And run up the top, this side of the hill, I guess try and get it maybe a section of straight road and then maybe maybe I should have it going out in this way 
I think that is what I'm going to do. So I'll have it going out in this direction, which then means I would need another road that connects up there. But that has just opened up all of these roads to for me to jump onto that road there. So I am going to do this. I'm just going to connect up every road that I possibly can to my city motorway or dual carriageway junction. So this road, which is currently just a two-way road, can also look at being hooked up to that. And of course it could go over in the future if I wanted it to, but right now it does not. Probably have off this roundabout probably pop another road in just like this heading out towards this road too and that is actually opening up the shape of the city for me because that shows just how I would build all the various bits of you know, this bit here this bit here this bit would go this way so that does really open up the, the city shape and of course further on what would happen is this would these would become junctions that would be little flyovers or things like that so that i can have housing out here or, or whatever but this is a city that i would say is big enough for a hundred thousand people over a hundred thousand people it doesn't feel safe at night going out at night with all the crime around if I check the crime rate and this is 1%, then 1%. Crime success rate, 0%. There is no... There is no way you can be concerned about this. Just... I'm very, very confused. Now, what is this... This thing? What would this do? Very... Very curious, if that is an oak tree, which we have loads of, if I find an oak tree, just curious, I plant, place multiple, an oak tree, let, just as a test, I'm just going to put a bunch of oak trees somewhere, here. Uh, wait, check if this is a specialised industry, industry to start with. It says natural resources. That's the trees. Um, that is just the trees, isn't it? Apparently those are not. So why are those not while these are? No idea. I could actually go out here and start making farms. That would be useful. I should probably do that. We have the motorway. Um, right, pick a spot. There. Right here. If I place a whole heap of trees here, probably have another achievement. Will these brush strength, give me a really high brush strength, will these become a natural resource to harvest? There we go. I have no idea how long these will take to to grow, but would this become a natural resource? That is what I'm curious about. Uh, this is a, the A2. A2. Not Victoria Highway. A2. Autumn Highway? No. A2. It's the A1. 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 I'm sure I can come up with names beyond just the A road numbers. There we go. That is the A1 all the way down. Okay. This is the A2 all the way in, which it is happy to remain the A2 right the way into the city centre. Perhaps that should be the A1 then, but it does not matter. There we go, that is fine. 
I think I want to wanted to rename all of this to the A one hundred. Actually, no, A one o two, because it joins between the A one and A two. Sorry, M one and A two. That will do. Good. Um, and this road, this one can be something. So this can be the. A101. That is the A101 all the way up. Good. Realistically, I guess we could say the A101 is this weird circular thing. We'll see. I will have to have a look. A101 and leave it at this roundabout. Um, I need names for these. I, I do need names for these. Yes, that, that would be useful. Simple name. Riverside Roundabout. Very, very simple. Um, Knightsbridge City Centre Bypass. That's the Knightsbridge City Centre Bypass. Um, this can be the... Oh, this is the A102 flyover, but that doesn't matter. Ivy Highway. And no, I'd want that bit and this bit to be different, so that isn't going to work. Okay, that is working. So many people are getting sick. I am so confused. At how, how much more can I give you? I'm very, very confused. I'm doing the best I can here. Sick or injured, 49. Capacity. Average health has gone up. I'm I'm doing everything I possibly can. Um, right. Let's see. Fuel plant. Ooh. That is something that has to be in this area, surely. Okay, these are things... These are the sort of things I need to look at. Um, I'll have to look at offices and things like that later on. Right, what else do I want to do? Uh, subways, I did say I was going to look at subways, didn't I? So let's have a look at how these work. Is this underground or overground? Let's click it so that I can see it. It is overground. Okay. Subway. Overground station. Okay, so we have overground stations and underground stations. Probably going to stick with the undergrounds, to be completely honest. Um, yeah, I'll probably stick with the undergrounds. And the yard can be... Well, look, there's, there's the overground main railway national... National Rail Yard. No, let me put... I'd have to put this somewhere out here. I think I'm going to have to put it somewhere out here, the, the tube yard. Okay, that is going to be later on. There is something else I wanted to do here, and that was fix this road. I found that this is a little low, obviously. And I wanted to lift it more to that height. So, I'm going to do that. I'm going to get rid of all of these offices and yeah, just all of these offices are going to go and I'm going to fix this, this little bit. So, first off, bulldoze. And obviously the connection to these roads will then disappear too. But I will work on the road connections in a minute. Or in a few minutes. I know people are disappointed, they're angry, they're upset, whatever, but I'm going to fix this because this is, this, this is all something that I said I wanted to improve and so I am going to, I'm going to pick a, some sort of a height, which I think this is a, this is a better height, so I'll work there, 
from there and try and do something about this this road all the way up to I'm going to start by fixing it up to there then I will work on the next bit easy way to fix this is to do that 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 allows me to break these bits of the roads uh, not that bit um, there we go that allows me to then do that now what am I looking at the height of this so this looks like a good height just here first thing I need to do is get that leveling tool now that I know how some of these things work and I'm going to try to level yeah, start by leveling at this at this height there we go then increase this to the width of the road or pretty much the width of the road and start working on it so we find that there we end up going fairly low down I'm not entirely sure why but I'll work I'll, I'll try and figure out what is going on here right so that is that bit now up here on the other hand we are fairly high up so if I do this you can see where the road is oh you can see where the road is and just how high up from the river it needs to become and I am okay with that as long as it doesn't impact right I'm not okay with that so I will soften this out again and pick a, a pick a different spot there we go I will pick a different spot so I'm going to find the ideal spot here which I'm going to say is perhaps that high there we go that is the height that we are now staying at at minimum so if I go around here there we go it's going to do that which obviously then means that that is a problem but if I first focus on this bit this is my primary focus this section here you can see how the road how this changes a little so these go slightly further down so what I will do is I will pick what, what height should I pick this height here that there and from here it's going to go down to there there's the first little level change what I then want to do is remain at this said level as I come around here uh, we've got another one so maybe it needs to come back down to so here I'm going to pick that bit and it goes down so just there I'll soften this up obviously now we have a new level and then see how low that is compared to the rest so then I'm going to pick uh, let's pick let's see this bit and we are going to from here go down to there so from there down we go and that is that is a more reasonable height and then this road this bridge here is going to have to do something because this is yeah this is a little bit messy as you can see so we will then very gently make an attempt here 
to go from there down to that height. And then that will have to smooth, soften up a little. So I'll go ahead and attempt to soften this bit like that. And that is where the road is going to go, which is going to be a good way to end this end this video with much a much better uh, road set. So this is a, a two-way road. Uh, sorry, a four-lane road still. So you begin there and just follow this road around with no snapping whatsoever. Just all the way around. Up the hill you're going to, you go. Come on, round we go. Round like that. Continue all the way around. It's not quite up to the end there anymore, but that's okay. That is completely okay. I can even adjust the river here if, if need be. Right the way up to there, and we will sort everything out. In fact, no. I'll get rid of that bit. I'll get rid of that bit, and we will sort things out beyond that later. But now, I can connect this up to this without too much of a hassle. Come on, straight down. There we go. This one can connect there. This one can connect there. This one can connect there. If I wanted to, I can connect this one here, I guess. And this isn't too much of a change in, in the hill. Then I come along here and then just go soften soften all of this up a little. There we go. Just improve some of this. Like that. And then potentially I could wall this up, but I'll start by softening it. And we'll work on the walls later. Like key walls and stuff. There. See, that is right on the edge. So I would want to fix that a little and then put the offices back in. Like so. Without the high rises. And what else do I do? Oop, not that. This is not what I do. Do this and... You know what? Why not? Pop a little bit more housing in there. A few houses there. Why not? I don't think people are going to like living down here, so I'm not going to do that. They may like this bit, but I will have to see. And that looks fairly good. Uh, one more primary school needs to go in, and that primary school can be down... You know what? Let's just pop, pop it in here and remove the people. Sorry, we, ha we, we are going to have to do this. And all primary schools are now going to have um, extra... a playground. We're going to have a playground and extra capacity. What did I do to... oh, that button. Excellent. Okay. Let's play. Now we are going to lose, or some people are going to move out. But with all of this improvement, what's this? Condemned, yes, yes. Um, I'm sure they will be fixed. Not sure why that random house there is condemned, but we should have some some fixing to to do. And with all of that now complete, we get to see traffic in uh, everywhere else, I suppose. Is this being used? Is this road being used? No. Yes. Yes, it is. Excellent. People are using this road. Oh, it just says EU. It's not really a motorway, but it's the best I can, best I can do. This should probably have traffic lights, to be honest. I think I'm going to put traffic lights here. There we go. 
Okay, well, you have decided that you want to go that way now. That bit could also be improved. That, So I thought that was going to be straight, but so that is the issue that we seem to have even with this, this one here. Whoa, that's a lot of people walking across this bridge. Wait, what? Where are all of you people going? You're all walking along this bridge to go where? Or come back from where? Interesting. Very interesting. And we are now only making two million because we have upkeeps of, for example, for the hospital, the extra roads, um, and all of those sorts of stuff. That has has changed. So does it tell there you go, nearly a million just on the hospital. But that is important. That is very important. So that, I think, brings me to the end of this video. I could start trying to bring a little bit more of this commercial in, but I also want to start figuring out more places to live. Now, what if I change this to medium density? What, what would that do? Not sure. Not sure at all. So what I could do here, though, is build a road. I know I should not be doing this, but if I start with a, a road like this and then put, let's try and do some parallel roads here. Like that, and like that, and like that. But this road, this road curves, and joins up here because it likes being awkward. Whereas these roads will turn and join, one can connect there. And one can connect there, like that. I'm going to be causing myself grief here by, by doing what I'm doing. Um, slope, tool here, right click, down we go. Don't right click, down we go. Uh, right click, down we go. Right click, down we go. Right click there, down we go. And then soften all the terrain as night falls once again to try and improve this hill just a little. There we go. That sort of works. This is a very hilly area. That does make it a little difficult to build, to put housing and all of that sort of stuff. Um, what's the schools like now? Uh, schools. That isn't it. Education. Still not enough. I'm absolutely maxing out everything I can with the schools. It is just still not enough. I'm pushing as much as I can, so I cannot really add any more to the housing in this area. Because if I do that, we are going to need more schools. But I can just start building the roads, I guess. So if I do this, in fact, something like that. And then maybe just match that. Like that. And then over here, I'll have a 
maybe something along those lines with a strange looking little uh, how am I going to do this a little road like that in there there we go I suppose if you really want to you could do something like that Okay. This is supposed to be the end of this episode a long time ago, but I've just gone ahead and said, right, I'm building all the next, all the new stuff. Um, I would like to put some, maybe some commercial down this road. A little bit of commercial. So just, just here, just a, a small amount of commercial just in this area like that and then a school again this is going to be again uh, now at this point I may need to actually start looking at secondary schools as well but I'm going to pop a primary school down Manor Street complete with uh, that and a playground right there. Good. And then I'm going to look at putting a secondary school in somewhere. Now that is going to have to be out. Now I think I should put another sec. If I put a secondary school in, I'll put it in on this side. So, what does that do to the education? We're just about okay. We are just managing now. Which is fine. So, this is apparently 2.30 in the morning. What is going on? Um, and to end this episode, just because I can, uh, here we go. Let's just start filling all of this up. Just like that. There we go. Oh, and I suppose I could put a little medical clinic down here too. Why not? Um, here. Little clinic with uh, an extension wing at the back. Sure. That, that will work. Okay, and with that, I'm going to end this video. So, where should I... Where should I take the opportunity to take a screenshot from? Maybe, actually, just a, a large shot of the everything. Why is it so bright right now? I have absolutely no idea. Uh, do that. That will probably work a little better. Something is very wrong with, with the lighting in this title now. I want to... I cannot get a proper screenshot, unfortunately, because something's gone very wrong with the title, with the lighting. But I will end the video there. So, where is the sun? That is the other question. Where, where has it... There it is. Why is the sun at three in the morning? I suppose it would come up at three in the morning. No, it would. Yes, I suppose it would. Okay, maybe, maybe it is correct. It's just weird, oddly lit. Um... Right, as I said, I'm going to end this video, so thank you very much for watching. Please remember to click on the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to the channel for more videos on City Skylines 2 and the city of whatever this is. City of Knightsbridge, that is it. If you can do so, please do consider supporting me on Patreon. Link in the description box below. Uh, for, for that, so do go check that out, as well as links to my social media and Discord server. That is all from me, and I shall see you next time in City Skylines 2, where I will be able to build this, because this is only a few, few XP, just less than, a, less than 200 XP. Rema less than... We have 30 XP remaining to be able to unlock all of these tiles. And of course, with all these people moving in, 
the money will also increase. So that will be great. So make sure you stay tuned for the next video. I'll see you then.